Thanksgiving week for the University of Iowa. And as we gear up towards all the fun-filled events, we have special guests to explain them all. Matt McDonald, the homecoming executive director, and Lexi Olson, the homecoming VP of marketing, joins us today. Hi. Hi. You both are also students at Iowa, right? Yes. Seniors? Yes. And you, have you been on the council for more than one year? Is this your first year? Go ahead. This is my second year on the council. This is my fourth. Fourth. Wow, all of the years. I know. And your executive director of homecoming. Tell us how long homecoming has been a thing at the University of Iowa. Homecoming started in 1912 uh, as a way to promote school spirit across Iowa City, bring people together, and it has just grown exponentially ever since. Yeah. And this year is special because it's 100 years of the button. Yes. Is that right? So give us a little bit of, of background on the button. Yeah, so as we said, it's 100 years of homecoming buttons, um, and people are really excited about it. We have avid collectors who have been waiting on something like this, um, and so with 100 years, we wanted something to commemorate that milestone and really celebrate Absolutely. the University of Iowa um, homecoming history. And here you you brought one. Yes. And there's only been 100 made. Is yes, right? so we are auctioning off 100 special edition homecoming enamel pins this year. They are textured, they are hard metal, they are three and a half inches across, and they are absolutely awesome. Yeah, they're beautiful. We're going to be auctioning them this week, Tuesday through Sunday, on our website. Okay, on the homecoming website yes. of the university. What other events? Are happening this week. Homecoming is the largest week of student-run programming on campus. Mm -hmm. So, actually, started yesterday with our Homecoming 5K, yes. and it goes all the way through our flagship parade on Friday, where we invite 125 community groups, student organizations, and departments from across the greater Iowa City area to come and join us for this the biggest party of the fall. It is a big party. You, you'll have a lot of people down there for the parade, I'm sure. Yeah. How do you plan these events? It, you know, there's. There's so many people coming and you want to have everybody involved. How, how do you do that? It takes a village, for <laughs> sure. We have a whole um, group dedicated specifically to organizing events um, and making those happen. Mm -hmm. um, but really, everyone on council, we all work together to make sure that everything goes smoothly. How many students are on the council? There are 16 of us. Okay. that's. That's not that many for this huge week. Yeah, but we events. started back in February was when we started to get the team together. Yes, wow. <laughs> what special guests do you have speaking this week? We have Big E coming mm -hmm. to give a lecture. I believe it's Wednesday night, Mom. Yep. And he's going to give a talk on mental health and the importance of keeping people uh, in good spirits throughout stressful times in their lives. Yeah, and for people who don't don't know who Big E is, can you tell us a little more about him? Yes, he was a big wrestler back in the day. Yeah. And <laughs> awesome. <laughs> we always watched him on TV growing up, and uh, I'm excited to have him on campus. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, that's very exciting. Wednesday night is his talk. What about the parade? Let's talk a little bit about what people can expect when they come to the parade. Yeah, so we have about 20,000 of our best friends coming for the parade. <laughs> uh, we have five marching bands. We have a bunch of different student organizations from across Iowa City and a bunch of departments, campus partners, big groups. Um, you want to come see big floats. You want to come see a lot of people. Downtown Iowa City, 5.45 p.m. Friday is the place to be. And a concert? Yes, we mm -hmm. have Magdalena Bay and mm -hmm. the 502s, um, hosted by Scope Productions, following the parade on the Pentacrest. Pentacrest, yes, that's always fun. How do you see this impacting the city of Iowa City? Like in the past years you've been on the council and this year, what is the impact this makes? Um, I personally, I like seeing everyone come together, whether you're a student, staff, alumni, community member. Mm -hmm. um, I think it's really important to see the big Hawkeye community yeah. and celebrate all as one. Yeah. I always say because it's a Big Ten University, so there are so many things happening across campus that most people never see. And so mm -hmm. Homecoming is that one place where you get to really open your eyes up to all the cool things happening on this campus. Mm -hmm. And you don't have to be a student. Exactly. You don't have to be an alum. You can still come out. It's a really awesome campus and this time of year is so fun mm -hmm. yes. in Iowa City and you've got so many shops and restaurants people can go check out and we also just saw a picture of some of the apparel do you want to yes. tell us a little bit about the apparel yeah so we have t-shirts this year black and white short sleeves black long sleeves I think they're really cool um, so yeah anyone can buy those um, on our website homecoming.uiowa.edu um, and we also have our traditional buttons for this year. Um, we have lots of those to go around as well. 
Yes, if you don't get one of the special yes. Yes. 100. Yeah, <laughs> you can still add to your collection. <laughs> so uh, what's your favorite part of homecoming? I think it's just seeing all the cool people get together mm -hmm. in one big event. Like I said before, like there, there are so many things that even me being here for four years, I have never seen certain groups or certain departments before. And every year, I watch this parade come together, and I'm like, that was a thing this whole time. Yeah. So it's, it's moments like those where I get to appreciate how big this campus is and how big of a reach we have across the, kind of the country and the mm -hmm. world even. Yeah, it's a huge week. Yeah, absolutely. I'd say pretty much the same thing, especially parade day, seeing thousands and thousands of people come and watch this. Um, you really see how big the Hawkeye community is, and it's really great. Do you still have to go to class this week? You have like, kind of. <laughs> 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 Thank you guys for being here, and have a great rest of your week. It sounds like a really fun time. It yeah. is. Yes. Yeah, and I'm sure you, you will see them on Friday, or if you attend any of the homecoming events. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, all <laughs>